Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome to part 5 of how to build the Statue of Liberty in Minecraft. This is everything we have built in parts 1 through 4. If you haven't checked those out, make sure you go do so. There'll be a link in the comments. And in this part, we will build a little more on this side. We'll fill in this part right here. And we will work a little more on this side as well. And all you'll need for this part is a ton of prismarine bricks. Alright, and the first thing you're going to want to do is grab your prismarine bricks and come up here to this side and all the way up here to this part right here and there should be this line of blocks that is one shorter than this part so you can go ahead and place a block right here and then place another seven blocks right here going to the left of it Just like this. And that should be right on top of this row of blocks right here. And then once you place that, place another block right here, diagonal to it. Just like this. And now I can go ahead and connect these two parts. Alright, and for this next part, go ahead and ignore um, these blocks up here. That's just for me. And what we're going to do is come over to kind of the middle of the leg, down here. Where there are six blocks in a row, just like this. And what we're going to do is skip over to the second row second block in the row and go all the way to the top and right here we're going to add another 11 blocks going up and then place a diagonal block right here and then another six blocks on top of that And then one more diagonal block, two blocks on top of that, and then three blocks up here, diagonal to it, and then place four blocks right here, and then skip three blocks, and then place a block right here, and then bring that all the way down until it connects with that. So you should have this shape. And now you can just go ahead and fill it in. Don't fill in this part though, just fill in everything on the inside. And now you should have this. This is the side of the body and we're going to eventually extend this up and make the arm holding the torch. Alright, and once you've done all that on that side, come over here to this part up here. Right here, this is kind of where we first started building. Where we had that staircase and all this. 
and then come over here to this part all the way to the right where there are these two blocks that are one back and what we're gonna do is go to the left a little to these two blocks right here and then skip down two and then place two blocks right here just like this it's right next to this staircase but one down and then once you place those two blocks place another two right underneath those and then another two blocks right in front of those just like this and then place another two blocks right here underneath these two and another two right here in front of it and also add a block right here just like this so you should have basically built another little staircase right here and you can also place a block right here to fill in that little hole so you should have these six blocks up here going down like a staircase and then another three blocks right here and then this block right here and once you build all that come over to this last block we placed and then place a block to the right of it and then bring this all the way down until it touches this part right here and then come up here to this part and then skip down two blocks and then place a block right here and then bring this down until it touches this part as well and then once you've done all that come down here to this little hook thing we built and then place a block right here just like this make sure it is one back and then place another two blocks on top of that and then one block right here just like this Alright, and once you've done all that, come back over here to this part right here that we just built next to these stairs and these two rows of blocks down here. And on top of the big row, the one that is six long, place a diagonal block right here behind it just like this and then place another block on top of that and then place another diagonal block right here just like this to the right of it and then another block underneath it just like this And then place another two blocks right here. Just like this. And then another two blocks right there. Just like that. And that block should be one off. Alright, and once you've done all that, come back over here to these two rows of blocks right here. The one that is 6 long and one that is 4 long, right next to it. And behind the shorter row, the one that is 4 long, place a diagonal block right here, behind it, just like this and then place another block on top of that 
just like this. And then place another block right here to the right of it. And then bring this down all the way until it touches this part right here. So that is four long. And then place another block right here and one underneath it. Just like this. And then come over here to this one block that is hanging off up here. At the end of this L shape, this one block right here. Place two blocks underneath that block. Just like this. And then place another diagonal block right here just like this so that's two blocks right here and then one diagonal block right there all right and once you've done all that come back down here to this part over here back down to that little hook area like these two blocks, this block, and then this little hook thing we built. And right here, there should be these two blocks. And what we're going to do is place a diagonal block right here behind it. And then another two blocks on top of that. Just like this. And behind those three blocks, place a block right here. And then another block on top of that. Just like this. And then behind those two blocks, place a diagonal block right here. And then place another diagonal block. And then one more diagonal block. And then another block right there. Just like this. And then come over here to these two blocks. And what we're going to do is place another two blocks right here. Just like this. Kind of diagonal to it to the left. And then place another two blocks to the left of it. And to fill in this little hole right here just place three blocks right here on the inside of it like this all right and once you've done all that up there come down here to this part right here so right here you should have these two blocks and then a gap two blocks and four blocks right here and what we're gonna do is come over to the back side of it and right behind it add a row of blocks right here so all the way from the two blocks at the bottom going all the way up till the top of the four blocks right here so that should be about 10 blocks back here and you can also go ahead and add two more blocks up here just like this make that 12 blocks in the back All right, and for this next part, what we're gonna do is come up here to this little hook part again, these two blocks right here. 
And what we're going to do is right behind the hook, right behind this block right here, place a block right there and another one right here. Just like this. So it is a block, one back. And then add another two blocks underneath that. So now you should have these three blocks right here. And now place a diagonal block right here. Just like this. And then bring this all the way down until it touches with this. Just like this. Alright, and once you've done all that, come back over here to this row of blocks right here. The row that is one back. And what we're going to do is all the way at the top of it, place four blocks right here. Just like this. And it should line up just like that. And then come down here over here to the little hook area again. And we're going to place two blocks right here underneath the hook and one back. And then once you've done all that up there, come down here to this part right here. Where there should be these two blocks and these two blocks right here. Kind of diagonal to each other. And what we're going to do is place a block right here on the inside, just like this. And then place another block on top of that. Alright, and once you've done all that up here and down here, there should be these two blocks and what we're going to do is behind it place a diagonal block right here just like this and place another block on top of that and then do that one more time on the other side over here just place two blocks right here just like this And then come up here to the hook again. These three blocks up here. And right underneath that, there should be this block. And that is one back. And then extend that all the way down until it touches these two blocks down here. Just like this. Alright, and once you've done all that, come back up here to this part right here. There should be four blocks up here and two blocks down here. And what we're going to do is right behind these four blocks, place a block right here. Diagonal to it and one down. And then once you've done that, place another block right here diagonal to that block just like this and then place another block right here and then two more blocks right here so you basically made a little L right here and then once you've done that come back over here to this part and place a diagonal block right here and then place another diagonal block and then a block underneath this just like that and then we're going to repeat that two more times so another diagonal block right here a block underneath that one more diagonal block and then a block underneath that and it should connect with this part just like this
All right, and once you've done all that, come back over here to this part again. Back over here to these three blocks right here. And what we're going to do is place a diagonal block right here going down and then another two blocks next to that. So that should be three blocks diagonal to those three blocks. And then place another diagonal block back here going down just like this. And then one more diagonal block over here going up and then a block right here and then one last diagonal block over here just like this Alright, and now come back over here to these three blocks right here, this little hook thing we built. And what we're going to do is right next to that, there should be these three blocks. And then come over to the middle block right here. And then go one back and then place a block right here. Just like this. And then place a diagonal block right here behind it. And then a block on top of that. And then another block. So that's three blocks diagonal to this. And then place another diagonal block right here. And then a block on top of that. And then another block back here. another diagonal block and then a block right here just like this and also you can go ahead and fill in this little hole right here by placing a block back here. Alright, and now come back over here to these three blocks right here. And what we're going to do is place a block right underneath the three blocks so place a block right here and that should connect this block with those three blocks to make a little L shape and then what we're going to do is extend this block down by 20 so place another 20 blocks underneath And then come over here to this row box right here. This row right here. And what we're going to do is extend that all the way down until it connects with this row right underneath it. And that should fill in that little hole over there. And then go back over here to this longer row this row that we placed and come over here all the way to the top and then skip down 10 blocks
and then place a block on the 11th row on this 11th block right here just like this and then place two blocks on top of that block and then two blocks underneath it and then another three right here in front of it just like this and then come over here to the bottom of that right here and then skip a block and then place two right here and then place another two after skipping another block and also place another three blocks behind that just to make that look a little nicer all right and now once you've done all that come back over here to the bottom of this long row box that we placed and right behind it place a diagonal block right here and then extend that block all the way down and then once you've done all that come all the way up here to the top all the way up here to this block right here so there should be these three blocks and then this one block going down and what we're going to do is extend this block all the way to the bottom and once you've done all that come all the way back up here to the top all the way back up here to these two blocks right here and what we're going to do is extend these two blocks all the way to the bottom and so this is what you should have now two long rows of blocks going from all the way to the top all the way to the bottom and then once you've done that, come up here to the top again. And all the way at the end of this arc, place a block right here. And then extend that all the way out until it connects with the other side. Just like this. And so now you should have these two holes, which you can go ahead and fill in. All right, and once you've done all that, we're going to do one last step before this video ends. And what we're going to do is come all the way to the bottom, all the way down here, where there should be two blocks and another seven right here. And what we're going to do is place two blocks right here and another block right here. And then another six blocks right here.
Alright, and that is it for part 5 of how to build the Statue of Liberty in Minecraft. At this point, you should be completely done with both the sides and the front of the build. And also, the reason we left this side flat is because this is where we are going to build her left arm holding up the book. And I'm planning on building that in part 6. And I'm also planning on building a little bit of the back in part 6 as well. And then in part 7, I'm planning on building the head. And then in part 8, we will build her right arm holding up the torch. So yeah, that is it for part 5. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in part 6.